Hi, second graders. I'm Mrs. Robinson, and I teach second grade at Williams Ranch School. And I will be teaching you phonics and grammar each week. You will get two separate videos from me each week, one for grammar and one for phonics. So today for phonics, we're going to be learning about words with the short vowels, O, U, and E. And our phonics lesson each week will relate to your spelling words for that week. So here's what your spelling list looks like. This should have come home in your Friday binder. And that includes spelling words with those short vowel sounds. So we're gonna start with a warm up and then learn about each sound. I'm going to blend some sounds in a word and I want you to think of the word. Listen. The beginning sound is p. The middle sound is a. Ah. The ending sound is t. Listen again and say each sound after me. P. A. Ah. T. And now I'll blend it. P. A. Ah. T. The word is pot. And let's try one together now. Listen. <sighs> ah. P. Listen again and say each sound after me. <sighs> ah. P. Now let's blend it. <sighs> ah. P. The word is hop. Now you listen and blend. Oh. Ah. G. What's that word? Log. B. A. S. What's that word? Bus. And one more. P. E. N. What's that word? Pen. That's right. Nice job. I'm going to go ahead and share my B screen. And I want you guys to see this picture right here. Listen, ostrich, ah, now you say it. Ostrich begins with the short O sound. The letter O stands for the sound ah. The letter O can stand for ah at the beginning or in the middle of a word. This is the word trot. And the letter O stands for the short O sound ah in trot. Read it with me. Trot. Nice job. Next we have umbrella. Ah. Now you say that. Umbrella begins with the short U sound, uh. The letter U stands for the sound uh. The letter U can stand for uh at the beginning or in the middle of a word. This is the word lump. The letter U stands for uh, the short U sound in lump. Read it with me. L-a-m-p. Lump. Nice job. Our last sound card is elephant. Eh. Now you say it. Elephant begins with the short E sound, eh. And the letter E stands for the sound E. Eh. The letter E can stand for E eh at the beginning or in the middle of a word. This is the word shell. And the letter E in the word shell stands for the short E sound E. Eh. Read it with me. Sh L, shell. 
Nice job. So those are our three short vowel sounds for your phonics lesson this week. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next week for our next phonics lesson. Bye.